Hello, welcome to the truth. Truth is true news that you can trust. Subscribe here, subscribe here, then the truth will just automatically appear in your mind at different times throughout the day. Subscribe then, go on, subscribe. Now, the true news is the truth behind the news, but you might want to know more about celebrity news. I've constantly been told, why don't you do some celebrity news? There's not enough celebrity news out there. We're starved of it. Well, we're doing some. Actress Renee Zellweger appeared at the L Awards on Monday, and there's only been 69,000 news articles on her appearance. So to ensure that it gets the coverage it deserves, this is, after all, a person going to a place. We're covering it on the trues, the true news. Let's work out exactly what went on, in case them 69,000 articles missed something. Renee Zellweger, is that you? Yes, you know it is. Hey, I'm Sarah Flanagan, and the actress's new look is what's trending on ET now. Now, already we're beginning to understand that an attitude has been taken to Renee Zellweger's physical appearance. Let's learn more. The 45-year-old made an appearance at the L Women in Hollywood Awards last night, looking, well, um, different. It's not that different. It's Renee Zellweger. It's not like her head's been replaced by a marshmallow or a roller skate. Oh my God, what's that train set? That's fucking Renee Zellweger. Here's the Bridget Jones star in 2004. And here's her current look. she become a train set. No, it's just Renee Zellweger plus time. Beverly Hills plastic surgeon Dr. Linder says the biggest difference may be her eyes. Looking at her eyes, they are dramatically changed. <laughs> He's not going to get a little business after this, is he? The upper eyelids may have had an upper lid blepharoplasty. That's an eyelid surgery where you remove the skin. What if Renee Zellweger has had some surgery? Fucking, what's Renee Zellweger having this surgery for? It's like she's under some intense pressure. <laughs> regarding her physical appearance or something. I'm Diana Falzon with the latest on Renee Zellweger's face. I'm Diana Falzon and if there's such a thing as karma, I'm in a lot of trouble. The Richard Jones Diary star caused an internet frenzy after she stepped out Monday night looking like a completely different person. Oh my God, you look like a completely different person. Renee, what's happened to you? I'm George Foreman. <laughs> Zellweger has long been rumored to have had work done, but her most recent appearance made it look like she may have had more than a nip and a tuck. Plastic surgeon Todd Shivelstein, who doesn't treat Zellweger, told Fox 4 and one <laughs> What's your qualification? Well, I'd say my main qualification is I know nothing at all about the case. Quote, it looks like she had eyelid surgery, Botox, lip fillers, and cheek fillers. Yes, that's my speculation. As I say, I know nothing about the case. Shivelstein said the most striking difference is the change in her eye shape, calling them, quote, much more open. But to reiterate, I know nothing about this case. We got shots of Renee Zellweger out for the first time in a long time last night. Look how enthusiastic this guy is. We got shots of Renee Zellweger. She's moving around. Time has passed. The, uh, even while I was looking at her, some time passed, and she went through a series of changes, like Russian dolls, till eventually she was like a peanut. She came out, walked the red carpet, and completely unrecognizable. Renee Zellweger, over the years, her eyes. This is the thing that makes Renee Zellweger herself. <laughs> this is the thing that made Renee Zellweger herself, is their eyes. Not any kind of essential relationship with an unknowable entity. Not her personal experiences that she's been through. Not her talent or her charm or her individual experiences as a woman. It's her eyes. That's what made her herself. She's always had these squinty, pouty kind of look on her face like she just ate something extremely sour. And this is what we have now. She's not eating anything sour. I don't know what she did, but it does not look like the same woman. Everyone is shocked here in the office, shocked online. <gasps> Shock. <gasps> Shock is when experience is so extreme, it takes you out of yourself. <gasps> Oh my God, what is it? I'm afraid we have some difficult news for you. It falls to me to inform you that some time has passed. <laughs> so many people don't even think it's her. I can prove, however, it is her because she walked out on the carpet with her boyfriend, Doyle. And by looking at her. <laughs> like, that's another way of being able to tell. It's not like Doyle is there with like a newt or Donald Duck. <laughs> this is Renee Zellweger. This is Renee Zellweger, even though no one wants to believe it. So there you go. Case closed. You can try to prove me wrong. 
well, proving you wrong is going to be difficult. You've just wasted our life, and the kind of deterioration that human beings experience on a cellular level, you are inducing on a spiritual level with your vacuity. You may have been asking, Bridget, is that you? This comes from People magazine who spoke to the Bridget Jones star and revealed that Renee said, I'm glad folks think I look different. I'm living a different, happy, more fulfilling life. And I'm thrilled that perhaps it shows. Never mind this talk of being connected to your boyfriend Doyle and perhaps finding happiness and satisfaction out of the glistening machine of Hollywood. For God's sake, why do you look a bit older and more different? Have you not had something sour? Your eyes, your eyes. The positive statement didn't address speculation that the Oscar winner has been having a little nip and tuck, but Renee did add that, I took on a schedule that is not realistically sustainable. I was living according to principles that distracted me from the important things in life. Now, Doyle and I just like to spend time walking in the country. What's the fucking point in that? And didn't allow for taking care of myself. I was aware of the chaos and finally chose different things. Renee Zellweger guess trying to convey an important message of personal transition and may or may not have had, you know, sort of, so like it's like having plastic surgery in Hollywood now, it's like going to the dentist, you know, it's like just a normal thing that people do. So the important spiritual message that this woman is trying to convey is completely submerged in a, a glistening deluge of odd gloating and sacrificial sort of meanness. Perhaps I look different. Who doesn't as they get older? Ha! Huh. But I am different and I'm happy. So the main truth today is that time has an impact on matter. Here is a picture of an apple. Here is an apple ten years ago. Here is a picture of me. Well, it's not a picture of me, I am me. Here's a picture of me ten years ago, this phenomena of time wreaking its havoc there. Look at the Arctic now, and look at the Arctic ten years ago. Look at the city of Baghdad, and look at the city of Baghdad ten years ago. The only thing that hasn't changed is a McDonald's hamburger, because it's made of something that time cannot impact. That is some truth, true news, true news. Don't get caught up in celebrity speculation. Subscribe here. a tool that is abused to fool you and to leave you scared and confused. Truths is like the news. If the news was true, I want some truths. Let's have some truths.